While most of the Bay Area was still sound asleep, thousands of polite, cheerful and suddenly law-abiding marijuana customers awoke before dawn on New Year's Day to stand in line for the state's first-ever legal sales of a long-demonized plant. The sky didn't fall. Stone zombies didn't crash cars. U.S. Attorney General Jeff Sessions didn't jump out of the bushes with handcuffs. It feels great. It is long overdue, said Craig Ray Narman, a UC Santa Cruz sociology and legal studies professor emeritus who purchased the first weed of the Ken People's Dispensary in Santa Cruz to a round of applause. Then he carefully wrapped up his new purchase an eighth of a gram of indica flower called Nine Pound Hammer and went home to catch up on some work. The cannabis would wait for later, he said. Idle make late night TV more fun, the 69 year old Ray Narman quipped. Defying federal law, Californians voted for cannabis legalization in November 2016 by passing Proposition 64 with 57% of the vote. While it's been legal to use ever since, it's been illegal to buy or sell until now.